Dun, 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 dun. I want to be ready with onions, special sauce, dun, 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 cheese, on a special sauce, sesame seed bun. The beef, dummy. Dun, dun, dun. I rock the mic. And Other presidential seal on the left side of your screen as we're looking at it. The one with his name over it, that's the seal of the President of the United States. On the left side of the screen, do you notice that one looks a little bit different? Washington Post was first to report on this. I'm not sure how long it would have taken anybody else to notice that this happened, how many other people were looking at this footage, right? But um, turns out there's a guy who runs a website called One Term Donnie, which is an anti-Trump website. You can buy like anti-Trump merchandise and posters and t-shirts or whatever. That guy designed a Trump-specific satirical version of the seal of the President of the United States. Okay, for comparison purposes, the real one is on the left. This is the one uh, that was projected underneath the President's name at that event. The one that was projected on the other side of the screen, behind the President as he prowled the stage at this Trump youth group event the night before Mueller's testimony, that's the one on the right. There are subtle differences. First thing, look at the head. Uh, you'll notice uh, in the Trump one, the eagle has two heads instead of one. It's pretty much exactly the two heads from the state seal of the Russian Federation. The two-headed... Uh, yeah. Uh, now look down at the feet of the double-headed eagle. Uh, on the real seal, uh, you see on the, on the right, that's the, the talon of the eagle holding 13 arrows, representing the 13 colonies. In the seal that was shown behind the president on Mueller Eve, it's a little bit hard to tell at first glance what that is. You can tell it's not arrows. In the terms of the one-term Donnie website merchandise producer, he describes what's in the clutches of that eagle there as, quote, little Don Don's child-sized set of golf clubs for those tiny, tiny hands. So no arrows, tiny golf clubs. In the eagle's other little talon, where from the real seal you would expect to see the eagle holding an olive branch, um, the Trump-specific seal is instead holding a bunch of cash. And then there's two other alterations I will draw your attention to. One is the shield, sort of the breastplate for the eagle. On the real presidential seal, that breastplate is red and white stripes down below and a blue field up top. On the one that was designed specifically for Trump and that was projected behind him for his Mueller Eve Trump youth appearance, there's still the red and white stripes on the bottom, but the blue field above the red and white stripes is a little different. See how it's got those little icons there? Those are hammer and sickles. Like from the Soviet Union, right. I mean, just in case the two-headed eagle from the seal of the Russian Federation was not on the nose enough, it's the hammer and sickles. And then the last alteration you should notice is the words written on the banner over the eagle's head on the real presidential seal. Of course, it's e pluribus unum, out of many, one motto of the United States. On the Trump-specific presidential seal, um, it, it, which again, the president stood in front of for more than an hour the night before Mueller testified, that one actually says 45 s un titere. Titere. That's not Latin, that's Spanish, and it means 45 is a puppet. Doggy, doggy, we'll spill your bone. Doggy, doggy, we'll spill your bone. Doggy, doggy, we'll spill your bone. Doggy, doggy, I said, we'll spill your bone. I said, two feet, patty, special sauce, onions, Dummy, 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 dummy. Dun, dun, dun.